Hola. Y bienvenido a Styling Your Lipstick. El pintalabio que tengo puesto para este video es by KVD Beauty and it's called OG Lolita. Today we're going to talk about one of my favorite basics that I wear every fall, winter, and I'm talking about the faux leather leggings. I want to show you in this video how versatile a piece like this can be. I'm going to show you how to style faux leather leggings for fall slash winter, November, December, January, February. Let's get into it, bitches. Start off with the G route because if you know me, only if you know me, then you know that I love edgy, super stylish, out there type of clothes because life is too short to be basic. I love being edgy because it's just who I am to the core. I should just tattoo edgy across my forehead. Focus, Daisy. So the one I'm doing with this one is taking my, my boyfriend just came in. I just called him my boyfriend when he's my husband. What I'm doing here is that I took these leather leggings and to edge it up, I wore it with this gorgeous sweater by Aritzia. If you've been watching my channel, you know that I love Aritzia and their quality. It's just like the happy medium. It's not super expensive, but it's not dirt cheap to the point where I look at it, it disintegrates, right? <laughs> So what I did here is paired it with one of like the it type of look sweaters for the season. Sharp shoulder line that it has going on here. But I love the idea of wearing this with the leather pants and these sleek boots. Now I wear a belt and this is the elevated type of way. Now if you want to take the same look and make it a little bit more casual then go ahead and just wear it with combat boots you can wear this with sneakers but what i had to play with here and the way i would wear it is with these combat boots these punk boots i love the trend of the punk boot so here just took off the belt and then just let the sweater speak for itself and then just wear with the combat boots and this is how i would wear it for a casual day whatever that may be for you okay don't laugh but i tried to go the elegant route <laughs> We all know there's no elegant bone in my body as of yet. But I tried for my girls out there that have a little bit more of an elegant street. I paired it with this blazer, but I didn't want to do like just an everyday quintessential blazer. I'm here to inspire you, to lift you up, to make you have fun with your clothes, right? So I paired it with this tweed blazer and we wear a lot of black. And I tried to do the opposite of that. When winter rolls around because everywhere you look it's dead and i'm talking about those dead colors it's gray it's black it's brown what do you guys think give me a thumbs up if you think this look is cool this is the elevated version this is like you're gonna go out you're gonna go have a drink or you're gonna go to the museum you're gonna go buy flowers with something like this you can go ahead and wear sneakers with it i can see an elegant type of girl wearing this outfit with a little bit more classical type of sneakers maybe some white fresh trainers that are not gym like but they're like everyday like and just very simple a la chanel type of look like they have so many dupes out there something along those lines i just don't normally wear sneakers like that so for me i don't have it in my collection so this is what i would do with it i would wear it with just some type of flats and just bring down the outfit and stay till the end because i'm going to show you the va 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 boom outfit of this video this is for the tomboy i'm not gonna lie i have a little bit tomboy in me i will show you my chest but i already shaved here we have three looks because clearly I have a lot of room to play in my wardrobe with the tomboy section. What we're gonna do here is think like a dude, right? Like think like a dude, walk like a dude, don't shave like a dude. We're gonna pair it with a hoodie. Leggings are notorious for complimenting a hoodie and I have this one by North Face in my collection. And what I did here to kind of like zhuzh it up a little bit, but still like make it very New York and very sleek and stylish is just, I wore a blazer with it. And this blazer has these shoulders. If you looked at, uh, is it Balmain? I can't remember, Balenciaga. I think it's Balenciaga. Their biggest thing is those broad shoulders. So I wanted to implement a little bit of a higher fashion here, but still casual. This is casual. As you can see, I wore it with the sneakers. But you can do so many things with this. You can wear a long, jacket so it can have a cool like ominous new york city slicker type of look 
you can wear a leather to give it a little bit more street wear street edge if you will the beauty of fashion is that you can elevate these and bring them down and do so many different things of it if you are getting some ideas and inspo from this go ahead and give me a thumbs up calling all my grunge girls out there this one is for you I went ahead and just really dove into the punk look. I wore it with my jacket that it's all plaid. This is by Scotch and Soda and it's a hybrid between a jacket and a shirt. And I wore it with my punk boots by Mew Mew because it just really enhances that punk vibe. Because when you're grunge, when you're punk, you're a little bit more out there and more unique and you don't really care. And that's kind of the vibe that I was going for here. Okay, you ready for the last outfit? This is like no holds bar. We're going out. It's a party vibe. There's no casualness to this. It is November and then December and it's party season. And we've been cooped up way too long with the pandemic and it is time to rise and shine feast your eyes on the party outfit yes bitches i went all out with this i paired it with marnie boots these heavy duty runway boots for new york city this hard industrial brick like i'm in this raw city of ours these boots are made for walking well not really because it's hard to walk in them in new york city when there's like so many cracked roads and streets and this is how i would wear well one of the many ways that i would wear this outfit to go out because the leather leggings show a lot they're like second skin i didn't want to wear something that is super tight on the top i kind of want to balance it out and be mindful of walking that line to the raunchy territory so i always like to balance myself i love looking sexy don't get me wrong but with good taste right so that's why i paired it with this structure type of small cropped little blazer that i got from, from french connection years ago and i can't believe i still have this in my collection this little jacket must be like 16 years old at least it is old and it took it to a different level with the boots you can definitely wear this with high heels it gets really cold here and so i make sure that i utilize the boots that i have in my collection and what's the point of having boots if you don't get to wear them and experience them and have fun with them right i just wore a little bra under because it is the nightlight and get away with showing a little bit more skin i wore one earring i think this just looks beautiful and one of the many ways that you can take a full leather legging like this and take it out thumbs up or thumbs down subscribe to embark a more magical and stylish lifestyle hit that notification bell and join my feline squad